channel. This is Alessandro, aka the 3D Print Geek. If this is your first time here and into 3D printing, photography, and tech in general, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you won't miss anything. We're talking about filament today. In particular, I'm gonna review this new line from Azure Film 3D. It's called Skin. And in particular, I'm gonna show you the Skin Cappuccino and the Skin Latte filament, which are amazing so far. Let's roll the intro first and let's talk about that. As you saw from the unboxing, Azure Film Filament come in a very, very amazing package. Like roll, like spools are spooled in a very, very uh, thorough manner. Like they're really well spooled. And I mean, I love the finish of this kind of spool they're using lately. Uh, I saw a video that you can also purchase um, filament without the spool, like printing out your own uh, uh, basic like plastic spool and you just buy the refill check that on the on the website that seems very interesting getting back to our two colors they call them skin edition because they resemble a lot dark skin and clear skin of course I wanted to put it to the test I'm interested in the quality and uh, and how filament handle like struggles one of the first print I've done was this bear Voronoi style. This bear Voronoi printed out seamlessly and came out like really beautifully. Probably I could have pumped up the temperature a little bit more to avoid some rusty edge, but filament handled this really really great and that's what i'm interested in because color colors can be whatever color if it doesn't print good i mean it's pointless to search for the color you need this uh cappuccino is the first one i printed out and i tested vase mode pumping it out at 0 0.8 and this beautiful vase came out as you can see like it's perfect i mean it's a beautiful color as well. It's like really modern. And uh, I haven't tested, I, I saw that Azure on their website printed out hands in different color, like just to resemble the skin tone. I was more interested in see like the application on real life, uh, real life print. I printed out Ikea style O to see how it like, printed this out and it came out really nice as you can see and of course I had to use both of them to print this coffee splash that you see everywhere I think that in like six years of me using a 3d printer this is the first time I print one of those but this was like actually the case this is cappuccino falling out of a, a coffee cup and the cup is printed in uh, in the skin latte. Uh, that also came out nice. So quality-wise and you know uh, printing capabilities of Azure Film are unquestionable. I haven't tried an Azure Film filament yet that I had problems with. I mean, I really going back in time cannot recall. A filament that didn't print correctly. Of course, there's challenging filaments. I remember there was the um, uh, the bamboo filament that needed some adjustment, but also like oh, I managed to print that as well. So I think that other film is a warranty of like quality. I mean, 
it's a good price and a good quality of filament and as long time passes the more i realize this and the more is the go-to when i want to test a printer i don't want to have issues on the on the filament i want to be sure that the filament is going to print as if it would would have want to print on another printer it just loaded in my artillery x1 or whatever printer i'm testing and they work i mean it works perfectly i don't want to think about the problems that the filament could have i get give that for gra i give for granted that the filament is working fine and uh, that's the way i like to operate i mean i don't have much time so i need to be sure that the filament i'm using is quality filament that prints in a way that makes me understand the characteristics of a printer i'm reviewing so going back to our our colors as you can see, the cappuccino and the latte are different tones. Same quality of print, same temperature. I printed them out at 205. I think that's the best breaking point for my 3D printer. Maybe yours will be a little bit higher or a little bit less. But this is a not base which I liked a lot. I had in plan of printing. My wife is waiting for the review to be finished to put lollies in and put it in the kitchen because she likes it a lot. Came out really nice. And another test I've done was this Voronoi Deer. Very hard and complicated to print. As you can see, it came out very nice. I used the brim because the surface where it was like laying on was really small so a raft i used not a brim that came out really nice so overall this was a video of like presentation of this new line i mean colors i'm sure they're gonna come out with other colors and uh, of the same edition because it's a nice line quality wise i said it's really good don't forget that if you want to purchase Azure Film Filaments, you can find the link in the description. Use the code the 3D Print Geek at your checkout to have a 10% discount. Of course, if the, the price is not already uh, discounted, and that's it, guys. That was all for today. I really hope you enjoyed this like brief presentation video on this filament. Smash the like button if you did like the video. Subscribe if you're not yet subscribed, and I'll see you guys on the next video.